Celebs go dating, Sophie Herman drags Tom Zanetti into the bathroom for a passionate smooch as the pair finally get amorous. After much back and forth, Sophie Herman and Tom Zanetti finally got amorous during the latest edition of Celebs Go Dating. The latest episode of the E4 show saw everyone in the mansion tasked with singling out one other person they'd like to spend their last day with. Unsurprisingly, Tom and Sophie sent their potential suitors packing and opted to spend the finale with each other. Following this, the pair were seen giddily fawning over one another before heading out to join the rest of the cast for the penultimate evening's drinks. But before they could, Sophie could resist temptation no longer, yanking Tom into the bathroom with her and slamming the door. With cameras disallowed in there, all that could be heard was a smacking of lips as the duo finally shared a smooch. At the end of the evening, Tom walks Sophie to her bedroom, being the only participant to have her own quarters, and enjoyed another kiss goodnight before letting her go to bed. In the previous episode, the pair were sent off on dates with other people, but ultimately ended up flirting with each other in the bedroom, engaging in some X-rated, cake-themed flirting. While Tom had been on a yoga-themed outing with his date, Sophie had decorated a cake with hers. And this led to some raunchy chat between the pair as they debriefed their respective suitors. Talking about the cake Sophie brought back with her, Tom said, I loved eating your cake, your cake tasted so nice. This left Sophie blushing, branding him gross. But relentless Tom went on, you've got the tastiest cake, it was so yummy. Sophie couldn't help but join in, asking if he liked her frosting. She somewhat killed the mood when she asked if Tom had tried her date's rosette. Asking about his yoga excursion, Sophie demanded whether Tom had kissed his date, having returned with foundation all over his cheeks. Tom insisted he hadn't and described her as bubbly. That's what I'd say about a good fizzy drink. Fun, bubbly, sweet. Sophie mocked, adding, but would I want to fk it, or marry it? The duo were told on Monday's installment that they'd have to test the waters with other suitors during a session with dating experts Anna Williamson and Paul Carrick Bronson. They asked the would-be couple how things were going, with Tom declaring he was pleased Sophie had stopped being standoffish and that he felt they were more intertwined, comparing her to Bambi. Sophie asserted that the date was the best she'd had in the house thus far. However, both of their faces fell when Anna and Paul informed them that two new suitors would be dropped into the mansion to romance them, in order to test their feelings for one another. This is sure to rock the boat, after the pair have been getting closer. On Sunday their mate date turned into the real deal for the unlikely duo, with Tom visibly nervous around the Duchess. He also spoke of having little money when he grew up and how he started providing for the rest of his family as young as 14. I was still playing with Barbies at 16. Sophie admitted, comparing their very different backgrounds. Tom also recited a poem he'd written about Sophie, featuring a line in her mother tongue, German. That is the sweetest thing. She said, clearly moved by the gesture. Later in the episode, she was seen telling Kimberly Hart Simpson and Chloe Ferry about the date. This is what you've wanted, to be happy. Chloe exclaimed. Sophie also admitted it was the best date she had been on during her time on the show thus far.